Hello and welcome back everybody, this is Dana Code, and we're continuing on with the Avorian 2.0 playthrough here. And in this episode we're definitely going to be crossing the barrier here, so we're, we're, we're almost prepped and ready. We have found our Barrier 8, so the sector with the 8 asteroids that we need. And we also have, if I go into my inventory, we also should have all of the artifacts that we need, like doubles of them. So I have many of them on my ship already. So if we go here and go here, you can see I already have a few of them on, our, my, on my ship. But I do have doubles of all of these. So what I'm gonna do is stick those on to another ship and then park them in front of the asteroids and then the wormhole should open up. So, yay. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna take a little bit of inventory here. So I do have, let me see, eight. So we have, we need eight of them. And we don't necessarily need duplicates of all of them, but I'm just gonna do inventory here just to make sure that we have them all because I don't wanna take them off my, my main command ship to put them on those little small ships that we're gonna be docking to our main command ship. Anyways, so we have eight, seven, five, must need six here. Four, three, two, okay, so one and, what was I saying here? One and six. So I, I, I know I have those in my alliance inventory. Again, I have an alliance even though I'm playing single player because I could store things in the inventory. I'm not really too sure what having an alliance would do other than that in single player. Like, I'm not really sure what other benefits there would be, but this is pretty cool because now I have an extra a thousand slots to just store stuff that I can use for later and stuff like that. It's basically like having an extra, you know, case in uh, in any other survival game and or extra, you know, storage, whatever, on your base. Okay, so we need what six and one. I'm just gonna stick those over into our inventory over here if we have them. I'm sure we do. Where are they here? So we got that's seven. We already have a seven. And there's six. Let's put that in our inventory. There's three and there's a one. All right, so we have a full set of eight here. So we have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, blast off. So we have all eight of them. And yeah, so very cool. So there's that. Let's just close this up. And I'm gonna try to do a few of these too from the Izzy thing here, from the DLC, from the Black Market DLC. Might wanna explore a little of those things, but like I said, in this video, we're gonna be crossing the barrier and that is the main thing. So yeah, so we have all of this done. And yeah, cool, cool, cool. Now I do have this, so this is one of my pods that I made earlier. So these are going to be the pods, so you can see I have two of them, two runners here. One of them is, I think I can look at, yeah. So well, <laughs> one's docked right here, and it there's the outline and the build there. So I do have one, two, three, four, five, uh, there's six here, right, six, seven and eight so i have eight docks that i can put them on and i have one already made i had two already made unfortunately i jumped into a system and i got shot right the heck off because i did have it right underneath here and i got shot off so we're gonna have to watch that but so there's that and i want to look for before i do anything i want to look for a repair dock that's really close and is this one Oh, uh, yeah, it looks like that is the candidate here. So we'll go over here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here and I'm going to do a reconstruction site. So I'm going to buy reconstruction here. Or not a re buy a reconstruction, but a reconstruction point. So I'll show you what I mean in a second. So I'm going to go jump over there and I'll be right back. What is this? Oh, okay. So I saw an exclamation point here, but that's just because I have ingredients at the turret, fa turret factory ingredient lists. 
Sorry, as you can see that down there in the in the bottom. Anyways, okay. So let's go ahead and do that, and let's jump over there. And then once I do that, I will rebuild. Like I said, I will rebuild my this one here, and then I'll build two more. I hope there's a. I didn't even look. I hope there's a shipyard in there. Okay, so we are here, and as I was hoping, there was a shipyard, but there is not in this sector. We're going to go ahead and just go to the repair dock and then do the thing. But let me look. Let me just do that real quick. Well, let me look where there's a ship shipyard close, and hopefully there's a repair dock in there. So ship, oop, shoop, <laughs> shipyard, shipyard. So there's one right here. Okay, so there's a shipyard here that we can use. It is, it is the only one there, it is the only station there? Wow, okay. But uh, we, we can use that one to create our little runabouts, or runners, I should say. And uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and do the thing here with the, with the repair dock. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so repair dock, and we, we're going to use this reconstruction site. So basically what this does, and it's 1.6 1, 1. million, basically what this does is whenever we, a ship blows up, we can reconstruct it here. And this is basically where we will be uh, respawning, basically. So, okay. So there's that. So let's go over to here and we'll build some of those ships. Let's just do this and that. And yeah, so we'll build those ships. Hopefully I have enough resources. I should have enough resources. Yeah. And then we'll build those ships and then dock them and then go over to our barrier eight, I'm going to call it. That sector where we need to park them in front of the asteroids and open up the wormhole. So, hey. All right. Shipyard, who are you? How you doing, buddy? A cruiser. Cruising for a bruiser. Okay, so yeah, the Where is it here? Shipyard, and there, I'm gonna go make sure we kind of dock over there as well, or at least get close. Actually, let's just do that, so we can get close to it. And then, let's go ahead and talk to them, and start building some ships. So basically, we just need to build the board cubes, and everything else here is fine. And we just need just a single block, so a little board cube thing going on there. We definitely have enough resources. Gonna make it out of as much as I can. Maybe some, uh, no, some tritium, be fine. Sure. All right, so this is gonna be DC runner three, cause I already have two. And we'll build that. Oh, you know, I, I forgot to reconstruct that other one, didn't I? That's all right. I'll do it in just a second. Let's go ahead and do that again. So we'll build another one of the same thing. We'll just name it number four, like so. And do that. Let's see, can I do another one? DC five, we need eight of these, right? So we're almost there. <laughs> oh, okay, we can only do two at a time, it's fine. Yeah, so shipyards can only do two at a time at the moment. There's one done, and the other one's almost getting done. You can see the progress bar here. All right, so let's go ahead and just while we're waiting here, let's go ahead and... Yeah, so I'm gonna go jump back over to the repair dock and do that. Let me go queue up two more here, and then we'll do that, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I towed it here to the repair dock, so it is here now. I'm gonna go and let's go jump in it. DC runner two, 
and we'll go ahead and I think it pro it'll probably need repairing. So let's go ahead and build. I'm not going to repair it at the repair dock. That makes no sense to do that uh, because it's so small. So let's just go ahead and do this. Yeah, that's fine. All right. So let's go ahead and I'm going to go and ooh, don't run into the station. Let me. What do I want to do here? So how how best to do this? So DC commands. Let's go back over there. And then approach the other one. Can I actually? I think I tried this in the last episode. Can I actually like dock with it like this? No, just it'll just do escort. But that's fine. So we'll go over there and then we'll go and dock. It's just a, it's cute, isn't it? It's a cute little kind of almost boardy cubby. But I feel sorry for the crew on these things. <laughs> they are. To be sacrificed, basically. Uh, I think I should have probably approached with the command ship, but that's alright, we're almost there. So once I get close enough, we'll go ahead and dock. And we'll have two out of the eight. So I have, in the other sector, I have six making. You know what I should have done with these, by the way? I should have made these station founders as well. Because they can be ships and station founders until you make them a station, and then they can't be ships anymore. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure that's correct. Alright, so let's approach. So after I get done with them here, then they'll be, you know, I can use them as stations or whatnot. I'm probably just going to leave them in that sector, in the eight thing, in the eight... the barrier eight sector. And... Then, if they if they get torn to pieces, then we'll just reconstruct them whenever. All right, so that should be close enough, and we're good there. So let's go ahead and go into our command ship here, and then dock him. And you, I forgot, did I put, no, I don't, did I put shields on these guys? I think I may have. <laughs> Oh, I forgot. All right, so let's go ahead and dock. It should dock to did it dock to the right one. Yeah, dock to the right one. Cool. That works. I don't care what direction they're facing as long as they're docked. I should put a little like forward wall here, just to like I'll show you here, just like a little forward wall here, just so if I jump into a sector and something starts shooting at me from the from the front here, they'll be protected. But yeah, I'm not too too worried about that. Okay, so let's go back over to our sector with the shipyard and grab our other guys. Okay, let's go over to the shipyard. Where are you, shipyard? There you are. Let's go ahead and just kind of get close to it. It's going to be easier for me to get closer to it than the other guys closer to the command ship, so we'll do, do that. So we have one, two, three, four. So with the two on the ship, that makes six. So the next two I'm going to make are going to be station builders. I hope that works, right? The station builders can be ships, if I'm not if I'm not if I'm not mistaken. So build ship, and so what do we want here? So we want that. Let's just go ahead and do that. Does that? It doesn't really do anything to the stats. I don't think. I'm looking here. I don't see anything. So, yeah. So that's fine. And we're going to name the... Or no, we're going to make it out of Trinium. And we're going to name it... This is number 7. So DC Runner 7. And then just one more. Build ship. And Station Founders. Everything's the same there. Do eight. All right, so we should have all eight now. I know I could have used the <laughs> our other ships here, our other miners, because like these guys like aren't doing anything. But I like to keep them over. So my thing is, I, I want to keep them over in the. Let me just do this. I want to keep them over in the sectors that they're in, because once you cross barrier. 
you get very few resources that are iron, like the base resources here, iron and titanium and neonite. So I like to keep them mining in the like starting sectors or the outer outer sectors there. So what happens is that they uh, let's start doing this here. They will start gathering. They will keep on gathering those resources. That's my theory anyway. So that's what I'm thinking. All right. So six. Uh, oh, I did these 02 and 01, and then I did those. Uh, okay. So it makes it the name of those, but that's all right. All right. So I'm not gonna worry about it. All right, you, sir, come to me. Actually, let's just go ahead and do that. And then do this. Oh, do I need crew? Oh, because I need to build. There we go. That's the one, Danny. All right, I have these saved in here. There we go. And apply design. Perfecto. And I don't think I need. I don't think I need crew. Right. So that's just as as is as as is. There we go. All right, so let's go over to our command ship and dock him. And where do I want to dock him? I need to go to the bottom, don't I? And... All right, so let's go ahead and dock you just... Dock you to this one over here. Hopefully you do not run into that. Kind of go there, get as close as possible here. Do something like that. That should be fine. Wish me luck. <laughs> Wish me luck. And then T. And then let's go ahead and select them here. And then dock them. That's weird. Okay, so that should be fine. I hope so. He's he's docked. All right. So next one, and I'm gonna save you guys from watching me do this. So I'm gonna do the next one, but that's basically what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna go build them, and then geez, that was number three. We need to do number four. So I'm gonna build it and then dock them. So I'm going to go ahead and do all that and I will be right back. All right, so that is it. We have everybody docked in a skew here. We did have some pirates come in, but they didn't. They left us alone pretty much and got shot out of the sky from the local faction here because we have, I think, yeah, we have some cruisers here, so they took care of that, which is good. Cause I really didn't feel like fighting in this configuration. And okay, so the next thing to do, and uh, you know, I, I do know, like if you guys know a different way of doing this, that's easier uh, let me know because really this this seems it doesn't see it's not hard but it does seem a little overkill to have all those small little ships like that but there you go so it doesn't really matter all right and I probably could have just kept them as blocks as well oh the other thing I need to do right I need to put on so let's go ahead and do that real quick so I do need to put on so let's just do it DC runner one and I'm going to have the artifact for that to be the same number. So then I know where to put it in the scheme of the asteroids because the asteroids are also numbered. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. 
So F to interact with this. Now uh, I need P, there we go. And this is going to be, we are on, did I go into it? Am I in it? Hard to tell. Yeah, so, I'm, so my flag is here, my, my player flag is here, okay. So we're gonna put one on here, and what do I want here? Oh, I'm in the wrong, <laughs> I'm in the wrong place, guys. Okay, so we have two, three slots here, so that is good. That's five. Why are these not in order? Am I missing something? Eight, seven, six, okay, so there we go. So now we're in order. One, so this is one. We're just gonna put you on one. Fine, good, good. Perfect. And then number two, we're gonna put two. So going I, and number two. And yeah, I should've just looked up here in the name, didn't I? Go number two, number three, and what's number three here? Number three, there we go. Oh, I have to install these permanently, don't I? Or do I? Do I have to install it? I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out in a minute. All right, maybe they just need to be on board. Who knows? All right, so what did I do there? That was number three. There we go. So again, I don't know if I have to have those installed permanently, but we'll figure that out, definitely. Okay, so there's that. Now I think we're ready. Now I think we're ready. So let's go ahead and go into our flagship here, our command ship, go to the map. And I wanna plan this out a little bit. So this is where the barrier eight is, and I wanna plan it out so I'm going to jump, I'm going to safe jump because I don't want to jump into a sector that has pirates because I, I don't want them to, uh, as, as I did before, like shoot off one of my pods here <laughs> because I am at the moment bristling with pods. Okay. So we're going to plan that out. So I'm just going to jump here, here. So let's do that. Let's just plan our route here. So we'll do here, here, here. And that gets us into the distance there. P perfect. So, all right. So I'll go jump over there and I'll be right back. All right. We are here. We are here with the asteroids. All right. So let me look. Let's plan this out a little bit here. So we have the asteroids. And which one is which? Let's see here. So this is... That's six, so three, four, two, one. Okay, so let's go over to one. Oh, wow. <laughs> There's so many ships right there, it makes it like really bright. Like a neon light when you hover over it in strategy mode here. All right, so ship, and then let's go over to one here. Let's fly there. And then we'll deposit our first guy there with the uh, number one. So yeah, so I'm excited. So basically, like I said, we're going to go to each of these asteroids, park the corresponding numbered pod in front of it. And then, then I should, you know what? I, you know, I didn't even think of that. We only needed seven, didn't we? Because, uh, because we already have a lot of these on our ship, but that's okay. So whatever. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> Whatever. All right, so this is number one. And I think, I forget how far away you need to be. I'm not really too sure. But, or how close you need to be, I should say. But let's go ahead and undock. Let's do, let's, uh, how best to do this? Let me go in it and then undock. Uh, either way. So we'll undock. Undock, I said. Why are you not undocking? Am I gonna have to undock everything? 
Or do I need to be in here? Why is this not working? Why I'm, I'm pressing C, but it's not working. So let's just go and do that. Maybe I should just undock everything with left shift or left control C. Why oh, don't you know? Let's see. Let's try this again. So one and just undock like that. No, I think I'm going to have to undock everything. So, or do I have to be in this mode, maybe? Yeah, maybe I have to be... There we go. Okay, so I can't be in strategy mode to undock. Oh, developers. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. Mm -mm, no. <laughs> that's, that's weird. Okay, so this is number one. I hope that's not the case. Maybe that's just a bug. Who knows? Uh, where's my asteroid? There it is. So that is number one, yes. Yeah, that's number one. So I don't know how close we need to be. But I'm going to make it pretty darn close. Just like that. So within zero kilometers, <laughs> it gets. So, okay. So there. T. And N. All right. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to park this number two. No, that's number eight. Number two is over here. So I'm going to go ahead and park gonna go ahead and park the ships there and I'm gonna do a little jump cut and I will be right back So this is number seven, and we only have the one to do. Now, again, I don't know if I have to have the the upgrades permanently installed on these guys because I don't at the moment. Hopefully, then they're just the, that they're just a board will will help. But I'm gonna see. So I don't know if. My command ship here, I was thinking, I don't know if my, my, my command ship here has number eight. If it doesn't, I'm just going to take the pod, number eight pod, and then park it over there and then jump back into the command ship real quick. Uh, where's number eight? Why am I not looking? Why am I not? Oh, there it is. It is dark. Okay, so let's go over there like that. Now. Before I get too close to it, let's go ahead and look if I have number eight here. So I have two, three, six, and four, or no, yeah, four and eight. So I do have number eight So on me. So once I get close enough with my command ship, the wormhole should open up. So if it doesn't open up, then that is a clear indication that I need to have everything on these pod ships permanently installed instead of just installed okay so uh well i'm excited let's just kind of take a look looky loo around here so we have everybody near their corresponding asteroids and we're gonna go over to number eight here oh i'm excited <laughs> i'm excited and then we'll go explore if this works we'll go explore the sectors of the the inner barrier sectors i guess you can call them there they go okay you don't have to have them installed permanently it is opening up and if i do remember correctly that yeah a bunch of zotan come through but if you don't fire at them they leave you alone if i'm not mistaken yeah so there we got those guys So there we go. So there is our wormhole. And hopefully they just go by and we don't have to deal with them. 
We did have some Zotan. Oh, a bunch more come came in. So they're they're flooding through. But again, as long as we don't. Uh, oh, you know what? Ooh, uh, turn off my auto weapons here. Turn off all of my weapons, so nobody gets uh, any trigger happy ideas. So they should leave the area. I'm hoping, as they do. They're just hanging about here, and we don't have. They're not red contacts, but they are kind of hovering around my ships. And, well, no, they're kind of going away. I think. Yeah, there they go. They're they're jumping out now. Ooh, got some more coming in. Oh no, that's just cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, so good. They're, they're going to leave us alone. Hopefully. But as you can see now, we have... We have a... Wormhole through the barrier. Now, again, we'll, we'll have to find this wormhole every time we want to cross the barrier until we have a Vorian hyperspace blocks on our ship. And I don't think it takes much. I think it just takes a little bit. But once we have a Vorian blocks, uh, hyperspace blocks on our ship, we can cross the barrier at any point. And at that point too, we can also cross any of these rifts like this, so, which is cool. But yeah, so, how are you guys doing? Any more coming through? It looks like more is coming through. Are you just sitting there waiting for me to go through? Oh, it's a battleship. Uh, is he going to attack me if I try to go through? He's just sitting there. Interesting. I think that's new behavior. I am not entirely sure. Okay, so I'm just going to leave. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Yay. So I'm just going to leave my little pods here. I know they're there. So eventually, I mean, if they get blown up, they get blown up. And I can reconstruct them. And I'm just going to leave them there for now, though, like I said. And then we'll use them a little bit later on. So I know where they are. They'll just be hanging out there. And let's go ahead and undock my last one here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave this one near here, near the 8th. Near asteroid number 8. So we'll undock this. And then go and park him over on towards asteroid 8 here. So we know where he is. We'll keep you here. We'll keep you tucked into this little crevice. A little tucked into your little crevice there. And then let's go back into DC command. And now let's go through our wormhole. Exciting. <laughs> I've I've done this a few times now, but every time it's like, it's, it's still exciting. Building knowledge. Okay, so now we have, we're going to have to do Ogonite building knowledge, which is, you know, easy enough. We know how to do that. I think now, because th we are in upgrade, or up, I'm still on the beta branch. So if you look down in the bottom left there, I'm on 2.0.11. So I know... Oh, should we help him? I think we should. But I know there's... I think there's more ways to... Where? Craft... Oh, a crafter is under attack in sector... Wait, what sector is that? What is that the one we just left? Uh, I guess so. Is there... Oh. <laughs> well, the pirates are going to take... Pirates are going to take them. It says unstable wormhole. So once the pirates take... Let's go back and let's try to take those pirates out. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where's the wormhole? There it is. But as I was saying... Hopefully we're in time enough. But as I was saying that... Yeah, let's go ahead and try to take them out here. Oh, nope. There they go. I don't know. Oh, no. <laughs> Hopefully the wormhole stays open once those crafts are gone.
Yeah, I don't care, buddy. I'm gonna take them out because they are firing on my ships. Might help if I have my turrets on. Shield it down. Yeah, they're they're taking some pretty good chunk. Well, not shaking chunks out of me, but they're taking down my shields pretty quick here. But yeah, I didn't expect the pirates to jump in once I was gone. So that's something. Is that something new? I don't know. Well, no. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know. Are you guys reinforcing? Hold on. Ah, that means you got two left, which should be fine. Should be fine. That's really annoying. I'm not going to answer that until I get done with these pirates, guys. And... Come on. You're a tough little cookie, aren't you? He's pushing off some good things there. Some good loot. See something something I really want there. <laughs> Tempted to just go pick it up. Oh my goodness. Come on. Almost there. I have to look at my turrets again here. But yeah, it took me a little time, a little bit longer than I'd like to take out these pirates. Oh, how dare you scratch the paint. How dare you, sir? So this is the one that's hailing me? Alright, so let's just see what he wants. Galaxy, uh, you are heard. It's dangerous to fly so close to the galaxy core without strong ship. Learn that soon enough. But here's the solution to everything. You can save us some ammunition. Yeah, no. Nope. Threaten. Close. Yeah, okay. So, whatever. Whatever, buddy. Whatever. You're dead. You're gone. I'm a doing the thing. He yeah, is pretty tough though. What is his zone from? 4.6 thousand, which isn't that bad. Back it up. <laughs> Back it up. There we go. So I'm behind him now, so most of his guns should be in front of him. Hopefully now I can just take him out. Let's concentrate fire on this left flank here. Flank, excuse me. Alright, you are done, sir. We will file you under done. Just, boy, you're hanging on for dear life there. There we go. Well, well, well. Isn't that interesting? So who, who, how many did we take out here? So it took out one, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, says to, took out one of them. So what do we got here? So it took out one, it took out number one. That's fine, but so that's good news though because now we know that we don't need to keep these around here just to keep the wormhole open so that's fine <laughs> that works I'm just gonna collect some of this loot and then go back through the wormhole and then we can probably come back here and salvage a little bit no don't hit it oh my goodness 
I just wanted to grab some things here. Alright, actually, no, you know what? I'm gonna salvage this and I'll just do a little jump cut here. And then after I salvage, we will go through the wormhole and uh, find out who's gonna be our friend and who's not gonna be our friend. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, so we have salvaged the area. I'm gonna bring back my guys here. 1R, 2R, everybody return please. There they come. Alright, so I did take quite a bit of damage. I didn't even realize I took that much damage until after the panel and started salvaging things and I was like, oh, that's a little bit more than I thought. But I think, I don't know, I don't want to do it this way. Well, I mean, yeah, it's going to take a lot of Xanny on here. It's going to take most of it. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the repair dock. Oh, let's see here. Is there a closer one? I think there's one right down. Ah, uh, there is not. Okay, so I'm just going to go jump over to this repair dock, do a little repair here, and then I'll be right back, and then we'll go back through our little uh, wormy dermy hole here. So, yeah, okay. All right, so we're docked here at the repair station. Let's do a little repair job. Yeah, it's going to take, like, half half of what it would if I was out in the field. So that's good. So million. Yeah, we have plenty of credits and everything else looks good. And there we go. We are fully repaired. All right. So I'm going to jump back over to our wormhole here. That's interesting coloring, by the way. It's unstable. Like, does that mean that it's not going to last forever? I don't know. So I'm going to get over there. I want to make sure that at least I'm on the other side. So, potentially, like, at least I have one chip over there. So, potentially, eventually, I'll get some Avorian and be able to make sure that all of my ships can actually go through the wormhole. Or go through the barrier, I should say. So, yeah. All right, so we'll jump over there. I'll be right back. All right, we are back, so let's go through the wormhole. And then, do I have anything? No. Thought I had a notification there for a second, but I do not. All right, so let's go see now what we can find. Hopefully no more pirates go into that one section there. Did I? I don't remember. I don't remember shooting off any torpedoes. <laughs> How funny. How weird. I didn't press G. Don't know where those came from, but that's cool. All right, what do we got here? So we got some pings. We only have some mass signatures and no, I don't see any greenies. I don't see some energy signatures. So let's jump up just to here and see if we can't find any. I'm looking for some green ones. So hopefully we can find some friends here. And then we will find like a new base of operations basically. So let's see what we have here. So nothing in this sector, but do we have any greens? Looks like we have a rift here. Yeah, I'm not seeing any. Okay, so let's just, I'm gonna jump around here and we shall see what we shall see. All right, well, we found one energy signature here Boy, that is very sparse. Like, I don't know. I would have thought, like, I would have found someone here, but yeah, that's just, there's not very many. I don't know, is that, has that changed in 2.0? In Avorian 2.0? Like, is there, are there less factions in inside the barrier? Oh, I'm kind of curious now. But before, it didn't take me that long to find them, so. Maybe I'm just in a bad area. <laughs> bad area of town. Bad section of town. I don't know. 
So uh, yeah, we'll go over here, see if they don't have like a wormhole to another one, and maybe we'll find some more. Who knows? I don't know. But yeah. So it looks like we are not friends with these people. So let's see what we got here. Yeah, so there we go. So we have some wormholes. So two other sectors here. So this is the Evelaz, Evelaz, the Evelaz, whatever. So I guess we're going to try to make friends with them, maybe? So yeah, let me, I'm going to go through a few of these wormholes and see if we can't get a little better sc scope of what's going on here. So let's go through this one over here to the east, northeast there. So east, northeast. And that looks like Xanion Nightmare 1. Gate to Xanion Nightmare 1. Let's go here, actually. Let's go to both. Let's, we'll try this one first. We'll see what's there. I'm, I'm not too sure I want to go there with that kind, kind of name, but uh, yeah, <laughs> we're fine. Let's just go through there and see what we find. Alright, doesn't look like these people are happy with us at all. But what else is in this sector here? So we have just a few things. I did notice a resource depot in the sector that we just came from. Let's look at what that shows on the map. Okay. So these guys, what are these guys? These guys are the... Let's just look what we have as far as relations. Yeah, they are... They're not happy with us. We can pay tribute, but... I want to do that just at this particular point in time. So, but we're still sort of neutral with them, so that's not too, too bad. All right, so let's go back through, go over here. I want to look at the resource station here, and then we'll go up here to whatever's there. So yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> All right, let's skew to boot here. And go back through our gates. As I do a little, <laughs> do a little drifting. All right, so ooh, hello. So let's go see what the resource station here has, real quick. I highly doubt they're going to have any Xanion, and and we wouldn't even be able to use it anyways. And same thing with the Ogonite. Even if they have Ogonite, we couldn't use it because we don't have the building knowledge yet. But let's go ahead and see what they have, just to get an overview. So they don't even have any Organite right now. So there we go. So we're still pretty much in Xanion area, but just probably on the tip of the Organite area. So I just wanted to kind of see what was there. And let's go to the north gate here and see what's there. Oh, there's nothing here. <laughs> but another gate. So let's just go see what's through that other gate. And we want to go, I think, not to the south one, east, northeast. There we go. And we'll go through that gate, which is right there. So that'll get us more towards the center there. We are on actually the zero line here, the zero Y axis line. There's another energy signature there. But yeah, <clears throat> excuse me, but yeah, that's pretty that's pretty cool that we're there. But we do have some more energy signatures here, so this is more populated area, which is cool. And yeah, so let's just go see what's in here, and then judge what we need to do from there. I do need to take those docks off my ship, because <laughs> we don't need them anymore. Alright, so again, we just have basically two gates, a couple gates. All right, so the main thing I need to do, I guess, is the mid the first things I want to do once I'm over the border is going to be grabbing our our Ogonite. So we have we already have some, but we need to go ahead and get the building knowledge. And I was saying a little bit earlier that in now because I'm on the beta branch and we have we're on two point zero point one one. You look at it down here, that's what we're on right now. But I think in 2.0.10, I 
I think I read that they gave you more options to get building knowledge or something like that. I'm not too sure. Uh, we'll figure that out. But again, my first mission over the over the barrier is to get the building knowledge for Ogonite and then rush to get the building knowledge for Ivorian. And then we'll get that. And uh, my other secondary goal is to make really good friends with these guys. So we have a base of operations, a good base of operations on this side of the barrier. And uh, yeah, so that is that. And let me go, I'm gonna go through that other, go through that other wormhole there, I think. So that one is the east. All right, so if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to be notified when there's more, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell icon and you will be notified when there's more. I am thinking about doing some live streams as well and maybe during the week, because I know these videos basically come out on the weekend. So maybe during the week, we'll do a little do a little fly around and, and do it on live stream and things like that. So be on the note be on the lookout for those and if you want to be notified for those go ahead and hit that subscribe button and you will be notified anyways if you want if you are curious as to what i am using and what my computer specs are what i'm using to play this game then the specs are down below so if you're thinking of getting this game and playing it that is what i'm running so and it runs it very very well and yeah, I do have a new piece of equipment, by the way. I do have a ultra wide, ultra wide screen, ultra ultra wide monitor. Boy, that's hard to say. And that is new, and that is also down in the description, the specs for that as well. And I am really liking it, by the way. So it's really, it's really nice, very coming in very handy. So yeah. So anyways, guys, I hope everybody's doing doing fine, staying safe, and I will see everybody very very soon. All right, bye for now, guys.